Reporting Nigeria for Nigerians is the way the media can contribute meaningfully to the development of Nigeria. And this is according to the governor of Kogi State, Yahya Bello, also who uh, is referred to as the white lion by his admirers. As part of his contribution to getting positive reportage for Nigeria, he organized a retreat for correspondents and editors on how to positively portray the nation's image. Our news editor, Adewali Busari, was there and filed in this report. Let us put heads together and come up with some resolutions that will prove of benefit to our country. That is Governor Yahaya Bello addressing participants at the first annual GYB seminar. The motive, according to him, is to address the current challenges facing the nation. Recognizing the roles the media has played, he said it is important to instill a sense of patriotism among media practitioners. My definition of good governance is the ability to unite the people, events, things and places within your leadership space into an awesome or wholesome symbolic relationship. According to the governor, President Buhari has done a lot for the country and thus needs the support of all Nigerians to take the country to a desirable level. What's important today is community policing. Let everybody be vigilant. We're doing it today in Kogi State without state police. And we are getting it right, though it may depend on what you define as state police. Achieving for security in the face of current security challenges, the Kogi State government shared its experience, especially on how the governor has been able to ensure cordial relations with the headers. Which is the super political action committee we bring in the civil servants, we rub minds together and we throw in a lot of recommendations and suggestions to keep the state running. This has helped establish the required synergy needed for proper development and implementation of the administration. The Igbos are listening to him. The militants are listening to him. The Fulanis are listening to him. Nigeria will surely listen to him. It is because he has demonstrated capacity that he has what has become the bulwark of our national cohesion, which is unity. And that is what Kogi decided to do. Involve the people, involve the stakeholders, the traditional rulers, the stakeholders, the youth, the women. When you involve them in security, providing security, you will discover that what we are talking about in security in Nigeria today will be king of the past. The traditional media, the new media, the social media must begin to discuss it. If the media sets the wrong agenda, the society runs with it. If we set the right agenda, the society also runs with it. If we also decide to remain complacent by operating the agenda set by political actors, that also will become our lot. The session did not end without a deliberation on the debate on rotational presidency. In the end, the seminar gave birth to the slogan, Youth O'Clock, agreeing with the school of thought that the youth should be allowed to rule the country at the highest level.